speaking of mecha break, and I'll pull my I'll, I'll pull I'll pull this up again. I'll pull this up again. So mecha break has been actually doing really really well. Like uh, the, mm. the the play the play test is happening right now, um, and there's actually a lot of players that that uh, and the, the the PvP is really good. I haven't ex- I haven't received any lag, and um, uh, you can find games relatively quick. Like you can you can get into matches really quick. The customizations in the characters are actually really good for the pilot, and uh, it's always um, it's always fun when you can actually like play the game and there's no there's not much hiccups right there are some like like stutters in the beginning like when you first boot boot up the game but uh, it could be like you know growing pains but like i'm pretty sure they're gonna address that do you want to see how many people are playing the game right now yeah sure all right chat i'll give you guys 10 more seconds on this character i created which is the most beautiful character ever and uh yeah look Man, man, this game is great. This game is fantastic, man. But yeah, let's go ahead and check out Mecha Breaks uh, Steam charts right over here. 31,000 players right now. Wow. And this is, a, this is a beta test. Yeah. This is crazy. Like, mm-hmm. act, like the thing is, uh, most recently, the, the new update for Helldivers just came out, right? uh hell divers uh i believe there's a huge update that came out not long ago and right like even they're getting a, a resurgence of like forty four thousand players right it's it's not of course mm. you're not going to get the four hundred and fifty thousand. Yeah, yeah that's not happening yeah and the thing but is that these games yeah it is right these games these games are really fun right mm-hmm. these games are what yeah we, we, we got just got we just got raided by cody what yeah. the hell <laughs> Yo, Camelot, dude, what's going on, man? Yo, yo, thank you, thank you for the raid. Thank you, dude. Holy shit, man. Thank you, thank you. Yo, uh, I good racing, man. I saw, I saw the Tim Cast, the, the Tim Cast like NASCAR car, like the NASCAR. I'm, I'm not sure what you actually call it, but the NASCAR, fucking sick, man. Awesome, dude. Awesome. Yeah, that's really cool. But Camelot raid, yeah. Holy crap, man. We got raided by Camelot. Thank you, thank you so much. Holy crap, man. Uh yeah, Mexican. You need some Mexican friends because they love all that ass. Yeah, we love the big booty Latina for sure. Yeah, big booty. Yeah, Cam Raid. Holy shit, man! Thank you, thank you for the raid, guys. Holy, holy crap! Uh, really, really appreciate it, dude. Holy crap, man! <laughs> Come red. But uh, but going back to this one, like what what we got for Hell Divers? Just the gameplay is fun. Um, it's people are really enjoying it. Of course, like I said, it's not gonna get the the peak of six months ago. It was four hundred and fifty eight thousand. Uh, but the thing is that for Mecha Break, we do have hot characters that drew a lot of attention. You know, we, we, we got the big titty, big big booty characters that drew in a lot of attention for everyone. And then the gameplay was actually pretty cool. Like for my review, I gave it an 8.5. I said that I came for the hot characters and I stayed for the, for the gameplay. Yeah. But <laughs> Concord is mm. on the opposite side of that. Yeah. Uh, absolute opposite side of that so let's go ahead and see where concord concord's no longer in beta right now but let's see what was their highest peak <laughs> <laughs> holy crap man yeah yeah and, man. And the thing that yeah you have to pay 40 bucks first to play the game wait what wait, wait 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 is that free it's not free dude you have to pay 40 for a demo for like when a the beta game, for the game release when the game releases you have to pay 40 bucks kind of like hell divers okay. okay oh so, so it's not it's just not free it's not just free okay okay but yeah. yeah this i wonder if it's because of the whole pronouns it was an open beta okay okay thank you thank you yeah right yeah. uh like now here's the thing gray if they had a character creator or hot characters like you can do right over here like would concord made jesus I, I, every time i look at her ass like i, I get distracted uh, would concord have made um like numbers w- w- would have done the numbers like make a break would have done if you remove the pronouns it may may have had a better shot but maybe not as high as make a break because 
it's going up in it, it's it has the same genre as like the likes of Valorant, Overwatch. Like you have to have a really, really strong value proposition if you want people to play your game, considering there are much, much bigger players already with a very strong fan base. If it's a tough battle. At least Mecha Break is like a unique, like uh it's it's a game, it's a genre where you can easily bring in new players because it's not in competing against much, much bigger ones. Like this is probably just going up against Armored Core 6, which is a single player game, which people yeah. have already probably played. So it that's why. So it's like apart from it not being woke, it's immense fan service. It's catering to a genre where you don't really have a lot of competition. Whereas in Concord, you do. You yeah, you're going up, up against better games and they're free to play. So yeah, Concord is dead on arrival. It's 100 percent a Jim Ryan game, and the new leaders are just are just like saying. The new leadership are just saying, okay, just release this game and we'll let it die on its own very quickly. That's yeah. probably what they're thinking is. All right. Now, now my, my question to you is let's say if Concord was free, right? Because Concord is basically another Overwatch, right? And like yep. I mentioned, playing a uh, mecha break, it feels like Overwatch. Like of, of course, but the, the giant ass and the big titties you're seeing on screen does not represent the game as a whole. This is not the actual gameplay. This to be honest, it, it is the best gameplay, however. Um <laughs> <laughs> if let's say Concord was free, would you play the game? Would you play? Uh, would you play as this uh, gargantuous character named Amari with uh, she/her pronouns? I would. I one hundred percent would have played it for the content for this channel. That's it. Not because I like the game, but but here here's another thing. Here's another kicker. It. Sony even shot themselves in the foot again by preventing me from playing it on PC. I can only play it on PS5. I can only play Hell Divers on PS5. I cannot play God of War Ragnarok on, on PC because of their stupid, shitty new policy where you need to have a PSN account. So there it's really set for defeat, man. <laughs> it really is. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, the, the 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 thing is I I even even if this game was free, like, okay, let's say if this game was like really really good, right? It has pronouns, but it's really really good. I I don't think I would probably play this game over just because of the characters, right? Like I will deal with um like the like the if there was bad server issues, I know they're gonna fix it and stuff like that. I'll continue playing this because. The hot characters is what drive a lot of people, drive a lot of engagement. Like we talked about this at length with Stellar Blade, right? Stellar Blade, I had no idea what the what, what type of game it was. All I saw was a hot, big ass Korean girl with a big ass sword killing shit. All right, cool. She's hot. She has there's a shit ton of jiggle physics. I want to play this game. And the game happened to be pretty damn good. Right. Mm -hmm. And the thing is that they 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 I feel like they forgot how to do their marketing. It's because that's what it is. It's marketing 101, right? Who is your fan base? If your fan base are the woke, lefty, like brain rot people, yeah. Are they going to buy, go out and play and buy your games? I don't think they will. Right? They like won't. if it's free, then it, it's maybe, right? But the thing is, Overwatch 2 is dead, right? Overwatch 2 is done. Concord looks like they spent a lot of money, especially for the CGI. It looks real. It looks very expensive. And then you see there's this fat character. Every character has a pronoun. You're just pandering. Dude, I just want to play a game with hot characters. And the thing is that it's not just women likes playing hot. Women love playing hot characters as well, right? Whenever yes. we had the, the Sasuke sisters on, like we talk about, we talk to them. It's like, do you girls like playing with hot characters? Like, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right? And someone said in the chat right there, lipstick on a hog. Absolutely, man. It's it's so mm -hmm. bad. It's so bad. Now, here's the thing. If the game... Ha now, if this character was extremely hot, like, she she looked like Selma Hayek from, from Dusk Till Dawn. There's a snake around her neck, and she sticks her foot in your mouth at, at, in one of her emotes or something like that, right? <laughs> she freaking steps on... It's like her winning post is she steps on the camera, and you're looking up from her, and you see and you see her under boobs, right? Let's say that's that's the thing. But the game sucks. Hot woman can only do so much for your game, right? It'll bring in characters, but the hot woman can only do so much. But yeah, man. Um, are you sure you don't want to play Concord? It looks good, right? 
someone better gift me the game. <laughs> you want to talk about? It. You better gift me the game. If you want me to talk about it? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. <laughs> oh man. Thanks for checking out this segment of the Project Egg Row podcast. If you like what we do here, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will know next time when we go live. We do go live every Saturday at 8 p.m. Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.